guys, welcome or welcome back to AJ Otter Family. So recently I was looking through my big book of American Girl Doll stuff that I got a couple years ago and I just realized how cute the Girl of the Year outfits from a really long time ago were, just how creative everything was. So I picked out some of my favorites and I wanted to share with you why I think they're adorable and why I think they're just so much better than anything American Girl has put out recently. This video is in no way to like offend anybody if you have different preferences about the new girl of the years than I do. I just think these are some of the best outfits from the old girl of the years. And with that, let's get started. The first outfit is from Mia St. Clair's collection. It's her two-in-one skate outfit. Personally, I just think this outfit is so adorable. It's very unique. It has the hockey jersey with the hockey stick as well as the little skirt and the sweater with the hat. And it just has a lot of stuff that is very unique for American Girl. And personally, I think that because she's one of the older American Girl dolls, that also means that her collection just somehow is better and her outfits are a lot more unique than some of the new dolls are. And she is into a sport that we haven't seen in a really long time from anybody, I don't believe. So her outfit goes for around $60 to $90 now on Mercari and eBay. I've been looking and there aren't a ton of them online. And if there are, it's usually just like one part of it. I see that her like sweater and the hat are going for like $18 and the hockey jersey is going for $13. But the whole set is going from about $60 to $90 if you want everything from the hockey puck to the hockey stick to her ice skates and her jean skirt and stuff like that. The next comes from Jess O'Connell's collection and it is her me outfit. I feel like everybody loves this outfit. It is so unique with the oranges and the pinks, very tropical. Nobody's really ever done anything like that and they haven't taken any of those ideas really for anybody else's collection. I just think that the oranges are really pretty and American Girl really doesn't use orange anymore or any color other than pink. It kind of goes for $30 to $50 now looking at it. It's kind of hard to find the entire set. You can find just the shirt, just the skirt, or you can find the shirt and the skirt with no shoes. But when you do find it with the shoes, the underwear, and skirt and shirt, it's usually around $60. Recently, I've been really into Carissa Maxwell. I never really paid attention to her, but I think that her story is really good and unique. The outfit I picked from her collection is the snow outfit. Light blue snow pants and the white and blue sweater is absolutely adorable. The boots are incredibly cute. I just think it's such a cute outfit and it's very unique, very like aesthetic. And American Girl doesn't really do aesthetic things anymore. They do pink and that's it. And so her outfit usually goes from 20 to 40 for just the pants or the shirt. It's really hard to find both, including the shoes. When I do see it, it's usually in like a lot for like $120 or something like that. And if you want like the accessories for just like the snow gear, it's usually around $30. But it is kind of difficult to find the whole outfit. Kanani Akina is my favorite girl of the year by far. And her beach outfit, I've always wanted it, but it is so hard to find every piece to it. So if you don't know, the whole beach outfit, I believe, comes with one piece swimming suit, the little shorts, and then the hair tie little headband thing. And it is so hard to find the little headband along with the outfit. When you do find it, it is around $15 to $30, which isn't bad for something from her collection. But if you want the headband with it, it's around $40, which is quite a bit. I've never really been into Sage, but I think this outfit from her collection is very unique. It is her festival outfit. I think the one sleeved pink dress and the gold cowboy boots is very unique for American Girl. I love the gold cowboy boots. I think that it's just super pretty and it really looks nice with her hair and her eye color. And I just think it's a kind of unique dress. Even though it is pink, I think that the one shoulder is really, really cute. There aren't a ton of these dresses on the market currently, but when I do see them, it's around $25 to $35 if you want the dress and the shoes. I haven't seen the shoes for on their own, but when they are, it's usually around $20 just for the shoes, showing like how much people really enjoy seeing something super unique. And the final thing in this video is from Leah Clark's collection. It is her hiking outfit. I don't know what about her hiking outfit, but I've always loved it. Like the cargo pants and the simple graphic t-shirt that's not too obnoxious or anything, I think is really cute. And I just think they did a nice job making that outfit look reasonable for a hike and not glittery and sparkly because that's definitely not what anybody wears on a hike. I just overall think that it's a really, really cute outfit. When I see this one, it's usually around $30 to $50 if you want the whole set, including the walking stick and the backpack. If you don't want the walking stick and the backpack, it is around $35, $28, something like that around the retail price. 
Overall, I think it is a super cute outfit, and I would totally put it in my collection, and I wish I would have gotten it when Leah was around. So thank you guys so much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed, and if you'd like me to do another one, I gladly would, and I have tons more American Girl doll items that I would love to show you and love to talk about. I hope you enjoyed this video. Please share it with a friend if they're interested in learning more about American Girl doll items, and I will see you guys next time. Bye!